Hello mga kababayan! Hi everyone! It's me Yasmin, your single Chinese Filipino mom living in the UK with three beautiful boys. In this video, I will be doing something different for my dining table for Christmas 2018. This is just one of many ideas that I will be featuring in the next couple of weeks. And this one features the Nutcracker. So I hope you enjoyed the video and keep on watching. And consider subscribing if you're new. And give me a thumbs up if you like the video and hit that notification button. These Nutcrackers are the star of the show. The first three that you see I got from B&M for $4.99 on sale and the seven I got yesterday in a charity shop that I've thrifted for £5 for the whole and I think that's a bargain. So I'm excited. Let's get on. And let's begin. This is a gold sequent runner and I think it adds a little sparkle to the table. Next, I'll be using my red rib chargers that I got from Wilco for a pound each. I like taking the foam as well, so when you purchase your chargers, try to ask if they have the foam that comes with it. So when you store them away after use, you won't have those nasty scratches when you layer them in storage. chargers, I'll be placing my everyday white plates on top of it. And instead of using my everyday round bowls, I'll be using this star bowls that I got from Home Bargains and I think they retail for $2.49 each. This adds to the Christmas vibe. As you can see, I like layering my plates and bowls. The rib on the red chargers really shows and the star adds that Christmas feeling to this table setting. If you're curious where I got the table runner, I got the table runner from the range and it cost I think $3.49 for the roll. It's quite a long roll. Now I'll be placing the nutcrackers. I'll just be adjusting them from time to time just to see how they turn out and if I like the way they are situated on the table. After placing the nutcrackers on its own, I thought it looked a bit bare. So I'm adding this full garland just in between the nutcrackers standing back to back. You've seen my other Decorate With Me videos, I've also used these picks before, so I'm using them in between the nutcrackers just to add that pop of color and just to make it all come together. And every chance I get, when I see pine cones in a thrift store for a pound, I think that's a good bargain, so I always purchase them because they're not only good for Christmas, they're also good for that rustic look if you're going for any rustic look or for the fall. I'm adding some more pine cones to the table. Next, I'll just be adding these stunning gold glittered bubbles that I got from Poundland for a pound each. As you can see, this table setting is not a less is more kind of table setting. This table setting I'm trying to create is a more is more. So I'm just adding this small Christmas tree to the table that I got from Asda for a pound. I like them because of the white tips that they have showing that they've got a bit of snow on them to add more dimension and more color to the table. And because the nutcrackers are the star of the show and they look like toys, I'm adding these little trains. I got these trains from B&M and they cost two in a pack for a pound fifty. When you're entertaining, a Christmas table won't be complete without Christmas crackers. I got this box set that has the Nutcracker team through it for 50p. Nutcrackers 
purchase from my most recent haul. They come two in a pack from Poundland. And because this table setting is based on my children, I'd like to make it as playful, fun, and whimsical as I can. So I added the little decorative nutcrackers as well. I only use paper napkins because as you know, I do not like laundry so I tend not to use cloth napkins but it works well. I just wrap a red ribbon to tie with the red chargers and put little chocolates in the middle. And to finish it off, I'll just add some glasses and some cutlery to the table. This was super fun for me to make and I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it gave you some inspiration and some motivation and some ideas to decorate your dining table for this Christmas. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more Christmas table decorations that I'll be featuring in the next couple of weeks.